Hi guys, welcome back to another video on the Empire Minecraft server. Here today we got a lot planned for uh, building over here at our base. Hey, so I've been doing a, I've been a pretty busy bee, hey, uh, collecting all of the stuff that we're gonna need except for some glass, which I'm gonna grab now. And uh, yeah, we're gonna be working over here at at our base. So first, before we actually start working, I'm gonna go over and trade for some glass and we're going to be working on the building where I'm going to have my uh, super store uh, my super storage system uh, we're going to be using the impulse SV design I know a lot of you guys have probably seen it before or, but um, yeah we'll, so I'll link that in the description below even if we don't get to building that today just so you guys can kind of see what I'm thinking of and maybe you can offer some suggestions but uh, I think so we're, we're first going to start off with building the actual uh, build and then we'll start worrying about the redstone oh yeah so we're gonna start building over here here kind of just furthering this uh, build and to make it kind of connect to everything I kind of want everything to pretty much just be a, like even though they're separate builds they're like to make it just kind of feel like one fluid uh, kind of like you know underground city area here I'm gonna kind of build like a little uh, angled courtyard in between these two buildings to offer just a bit of separation just like a how much space should I leave it sorry if you hear some background noise the neighbors are doing a lot of construction right now but uh, we'll kind of uh, do something like this with a diagonal um, a diagonal courtyard here just so they're you know, uh, and maybe put put like a fountain or something here just to add a little bit of detail and then we're gonna build up kind of uh, this this area which is where I ideally want my storage to be and I'm gonna if we make a skeleton farm I'm just gonna funnel the mobs over here to an actual kill chamber oh yeah so we're gonna start building over here here kind of just furthering this uh, build and to make it kind of connect to everything I kind of want everything to pretty much just be a like even though they're separate builds they're like to make it just kind of feel like one fluid uh, kind of like you know underground city area here I'm gonna kind of build like a little uh, angled courtyard in between these two buildings to offer just a bit of separation just like a how much space should I leave it Sorry if you hear some background noise. The neighbors are doing a lot of construction right now. But uh, we'll kind of uh, do something like this with a diagonal um, a diagonal courtyard here, just so they're you know, uh, and maybe put put like a fountain or something here just to add a little bit of detail. And then we're gonna build up kind of. Uh, this this area which is where I ideally want my storage to be and I'm gonna if we make a skeleton farm I'm just gonna funnel the mobs over here to an actual kill chamber so without further ado let's get into the time lapse hold me close till I get up time is barely on our side Chase and leading us and love is all we'll ever trust. Yeah, no, I don't wanna waste what's left. And on, we'll go through the wastelands, through the highways, till my shadow turns to sun rays. And on,
Okay, so after working on this roof, I'm gonna need to put some like chandeliers or something and cover up the beacon. But uh, I think we're pretty much ready to start putting in the smelt, uh, the smelt, the sorter. Uh, I am gonna need to move this. Like, I mean, I can't move it, but I'll, I'll probably just cover it up in the build because I don't think I'm gonna build a farm around it just because of its location and I don't really need it. So, oh, and so. And I'm not gonna break it just because I won't. So unless it starts causing problems, I'm gonna just kind of keep it there, cover it up, and then put the sorter in under here. So let's go grab some of the stuff that we're gonna need. Okay, so this should be all we need to do the design that I have in mind. We might need a little bit more hoppers just because, as uh, that's kind of like this big thing, but that I'm gonna need, but that shouldn't be too hard because of my iron farm. Uh, if you're wondering what design I'm gonna use, again, I'm gonna put that in the description. It's the Impulse SV a design that he made six years ago that I'm pretty sure still works. If it doesn't, it's gonna, it's gonna suck, but uh, the only thing I am worried about is the hopper timing and I know a lot of the a lot of like designs like these break on the server just because it's such a busy server and there's a uh, and there's quite often like lag spikes, and like especially once they up 
update to 1.17 there's probably going to be a, a bit of lag a bit more uh, lag than usual but i'm hoping that this design will still it will still work okay so this is pretty much just the the bare bones of the redstone i don't have any of the the actual item filters in yet but that's what this where to put it this uh named netherrack is for um, basically, how it works is these are gonna these hoppers are gonna be the are gonna be the filters. The comparators are gonna sense how many items are in there, and will constantly unlock and unlock the hoppers areas that are underneath them. Um, this one is just bringing the items over, and if it fits into this, uh, if it fits into this um, item set, then it'll uh, flow through and actually get sorted. The thing that I'm going to work on right now is a easier way to input items. Um, so I think I'm e either going to make like a shulker unpacking thing system as well as just a shulker drop-off station and just to dump some stuff in into as well as um, as well as I'm just going to lower the chest for me to input uh, other items. So I'll just put like a, I don't know, probably just some item elevator or maybe just keep it like that but i'm gonna put it put in like the kind of the quartz the shell around it and i'll put in the filters so now now we have um before we continue working on the storage and i'm going to introduce uh tank circle well he's all he's also a member of the nation's smp yeah that i have another uh minecraft series on and he's also he's a part of the same nation point Medlin, and he's gonna help us out over here and he's gonna st like set up his own little little area and should should be cool to have someone else to work on this area with okay guys now we have all of the item frame tags and the item filters is in place um, so pretty much if I were to put any of these items in and to the chest that would go up here here they would be sorted in theoretically let's see this is the first time i'm actually trying it so we'll take some i have some stone yeah some smooth stone gray concrete uh let's see okay. um smooth quartz and and packed ice so technically in theory if i were to put these in this chest up here It would sort all of these. I don't have a gray stained glass filter, do I? Nope. And I just put that in. Please tell me that it hasn't gone through. Yes. Okay, I have like blue stained glass, right? Probably should have checked this before I throw, throw everything in. I was nearly 100% sure I did. Shoot. Yep. Okay. Now everything should start. Should uh should actually sort in. Let's see if we start getting more packed ice. Let's see, let's see if we got the already sorted in smooth stone. Looks like we did. The smooth quartz. Yep. How about the packed ice? Let's see. Yes. Okay, looks like everything is working. Uh, at least for the items that are already set up. We are going to need to extend this um, all the way around here. It's going to wrap around here. But uh, the thing is, I haven't really addressed this on the channel yet. Mm. But, um, but we're, I'm going to summer camp for the next three mm. weeks. But then Discord call. Uh, but um, but what, you're still gonna have videos. Those uh, I have videos scheduled. It's just I'm not gonna be making uh, new ones, so they they are gonna be pre-recorded. So basically, when I come back, we're gonna continue working on all this project. But uh, I think this is pretty much all I have uh, for you guys today. If you enjoyed the video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, if you didn't, please tell me why you didn't like it. Thank you guys for watching and have a great day.